Praise the Lord. Today we are going to see what we cannot keep it as a secret. Bible clearly says that we cannot keep, keep three things as a secret. For that, let us take uh, Proverbs 11, chapter, verse 3. Pro Proverbs 11, uh, 11, 13 says, um, Proverbs 11, 13 says, um, uh, a gossip, uh, gossip, betray your confidence, but a trustworthy person keeps a secret. This secret is we have to keep it. This is the secret of some other person's problem. When we hear that problem, we should not spread it as a gossip, but, should keep, but we have to keep this as a secret. But in, in spite of this, there are three things um, that we cannot keep it as secret. Um, what is a sin? Second thing is a scheming. Third one is the intention. First of all, the sin. Isaiah 29, um, the 13 clearly says um, that... Um, um, so Isaiah 29 13 clearly says that I acknowledge my sin and um, so Isaiah 29 clearly says that it is very wrong to keep the uh, sin secretly and people are thinking that uh, they are ready, they can ready to do all the iniquities uh, and all the transgression, nobody can see it, let them do it um, and nobody can know it and uh, Isaiah 29 clearly says, uh, woe to those persons who try to hide their sin. Because Proverbs, uh, Proverbs 28 um, clearly says um, that um, um, that whoever uh, uh, hide the sin are sinners and whoever ready to confess it um, and uh, their, their, their sins will be forgiven. And moreover, it is very clear and Paul also wrote in Psalms 32 5 that I acknowledge my sin to you and did not cover up my iniquities. I say I will confess my transgression to the Lord and you will forgive the guilt of my sin. So whenever we sin, what we have to do, we have to immediately acknowledge the sin, we have to confess the sin, and we have to feel sorry for the sin, we have to repent of the sin, and we have to resist the sin and keep the sin from keep the sin from us. Um, and not only that, um, um, how to uh, how to uh, how to have, get help against the sin also. We have to use the God's word. We have the, uh, the Psalms 119 says, I have to hidden the God's word in my uh, in my heart so that I cannot sin. We have to guard the tongue not to make uh, uh, to, to talk more and do the sin. We have to walk in the spirit, uh, not to fulfill the, uh, the desire of the flesh. Um, we have to avoid uh, uh, evil companions so that we are not going to get um, the share what is going to get uh, by doing the wrong thing. We should uh, have a, a exercise love because um, uh, the love can cover uh, the excess of sin. And this, in this way, we can get help against the sin. So first of all, if you do the sin, immediately confess it. The blood of Jesus Christ is um, um, a kind of con then easily cleanse our sin and make us holy. So the kind Second thing is um, um nothing but the scheming. The scheming also we can, we cannot hide it. Uh, the, the, there was a man called uh, Mordecai who was uh, uh, sitting at the uh, king's gate um, as a gatekeeper. He was a Jewish man, and his uh, and his niece um, Esther was married to Arthur's success. Um, there are two persons who are guarding the doorway were very angry with the king, and they conspired to assassinate the king. Success. Um, why they were angry? Maybe the king did not uh, marry a royal woman, but any but uh, another lady. So they may be very angry. So they conspired to kill the king's excess. But this was revealed to Mordecai. And Mordecai told this plot to Queen Esther. And the Queen Esther reported to king uh, to the kingdom. And then what happened? Uh, then the report was investigated and found to be true. So the two officials were, 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 were sentenced to death. Um, all of this was recorded uh, in the presence of king in the book of Annals. Um, so it is very clear that the, the king's life was spared because um, the king the king should be there to protect the people of Jewish people because great scheme was going to happen against Jewish people at that time. The queen has to intervene for the Jewish people. That's why God revealed the greatest scheme against the king uh, to, a, to, a, to, a, to, a, to the son of son, to the God's child, uh, Mordecai. So the third one that we cannot hide is our intention. But that's what happened in the case of Paul. Um, Paul was arrested in the, um, in the temple where he was uh, um, said that he brought um, the Gentile to the temple and not only that, um, he spread them uh, the, the, the the wrong things about the law of Moses um, uh, entire the entire provinces um, Israel. So what they did is they at that time itself they want to kill Paul in the temple premises, but but because um, the Roman commander came and took Paul from that crowd and kept him in the fortress. Um, so that time uh, the angel of the Lord uh, the, the, that, that night um, Jesus appeared to him and said, "Take take courage, as you have testified about me in Jerusalem. So you must also testify." 
occupied Rome. So next time, or next morning, what happened? There were 30 Jewish people uh, um, were fast, fasting and uh, not eating anything until uh, they, they had killed the Paul. So they went and told him, the high priest, that to please go and ask the commander to bring Paul out um, to the Senegal group uh, to, for, for further investigation. Since uh, the road of the Jew Jerusalem very, very uh, narrow, was well, they were bringing towards that uh, um, Antonio Palace, um, where the Senate group um, uh, were, were joined together, and in the road itself, we tried to kill him. This information um, was known to was, was information was known by him, the Paul's nephew, uh, who was his sister's son. So he immediately went to the fortress and told it to Paul, and Paul sent this nephew uh, to the commander's chief, uh, and the nephew told this information to commander's chief. Uh, immediately get ready 470 soldiers and took Paul in the midnight and early morning 3 a.m. to Caesarea and sent a letter with them to the Felix governor and emphasized that Paul has not did any mistake against the Roman government law but the, the Paul's life was not threatened here that's why you're sending there and when a trial comes please please him investigate that that way Paul's life was uh, spared and we don't know what happened to that 40 Jewish men who want to kill Paul unless otherwise they uh, until that they are going to fast him but God is the one who protected Paul and uh, want to fulfill what it was promised to him. In our life also, whatever the schemes that they, they have, the enemies can, can make against us, um, but nothing will uh, happen to us because uh, God's will has to happen in our life. And that's why Paul is telling in 2 Timothy chapter 4, verse 17, the Lord stood at my side and gave me strength so that though uh, through me the message might be fully proclaimed and all the Gentiles might hear it. And I was delivered from the lion's mouth. Um, so today we learn that uh, we should we should not hide our sin. Once we do the sin, you have to immediately confess to the Lord, and the Lord Jesus bled is him in order for us to, to to cleanse our sin and make us holy. Second thing, um, even though the people make um, are scheming against us, God will reveal us and take care of us. And the people talking with us, the bad intention that also God will reveal to us um, and make us to be very careful in our situation. I'll pray for you. Thank you, Lord, thank you for me that we should not uh, hide our sin. Holy Spirit, help us not sin also in our life. In the name of Jesus, Amen. God bless you.